Hello and welcome to another urban exploration through Aston's disappearing pub history. Today I'm on Litchfield Road standing at the former site of the Reservoir Pub at number 469. This Mitchell and Butler's establishment and was a neighborhood fixture for decades. However, the reservoir shut its doors for good and sat vacant and boarded up for a while, slowly falling into disrepair and vandalization like far too many abandoned pubs. By 2008 it was demolished entirely to become just this empty lot we see today. The reservoir has sadly had plenty of company in vanishing from Litchfield Road. Over the years, other cherished pubs lining this stretch have followed suit by shutting down for good including the Vine, the King Edward VII, the Swan and Mitre, and the Britannia. In fact, every single pub that once served this area has now gone. So in the space of a decade, this community lost an entire generation of pubs that had each in their own way been social anchors and support systems for residents. It's an increasingly common story across the UK as pubs face a perfect storm of factors forcing closure. So many British pubs are having to call last orders. As always, please share your thoughts and own recollections of Aston's vanished pubs. And make sure to subscribe for more glimpses into Birmingham's disappearing heritage. As we've explored today, the loss of beloved neighborhood pubs like the Reservoir here on Litchfield Road has sadly become a creeping epidemic. However, there is hope to buck this trend if communities band together to support local pubs. First, if you have fond memories of now vanished pubs like the Reservoir or others we highlighted, please share stories and photos of them in the comments to help keep their legacy alive even though the physical buildings are gone. Most importantly, utilize any pubs still surviving in your area before we lose more treasured spaces. Visit them regularly, attend events, tell proprietors you appreciate them, order takeaway to show your support during tough times every little bit helps. Their survival depends on us adopting the motto use it or lose it. If you've enjoyed this glimpse into Birmingham's disappearing pub heritage, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for my joyful adventure audits channel. We have an entire ongoing series documenting lost, closed, and at-risk pubs across the Birmingham area and wider West Midlands. By recording the stories of these community institutions before they vanish without a trace, it's my hope we can treasure what they represented while inspiring action to preserve those that remain against the tide of closures sweeping Britain. Thanks for watching, here's to brighter days ahead for the British pub and those still blessed to have one in their neighbourhood.